today is Wellness Wednesday, and on my channel, we stretch, we do workouts. So today, we're gonna to be working out with dumbbells. This exercise is low impact. It's not, it's not too difficult. Um, I would say it will definitely be for beginners. So what we're gonna start off by doing today, let's just go ahead and just loosen up our, our, our arms, okay? So first of all, let's just roll our shoulders back. Roll them back, all right? Just relax. Sit straight up. Back should be resting on the back of your chair. And we're just gonna roll those shoulders forward. Okay, good job. Okay, then we're gonna just take our arms and just roll them around, okay? Loosen those arms up a little bit. Helps with the range of motion and it prepares your arms for the weight. When it comes to weights, you have to do the weights that are, I would say, appropriate for you. I'm using five pound weights today. All right, roll them back, roll them back. So go at your own level, you all. I hope you all are doing well today. Oh my God, it's midweek. Okay, go ahead and cross those fingers together and pull it out. Stretch it out, you feel a nice pull in your arm, your wrist area, fingers, nice pull. I hope y'all are doing well. It's midweek. We made it, y'all, to midweek. Push those arms up. Push those arms behind. Behind your head. Push it up. Push it behind your head. Working those shoulders. your own rate, okay? Let's do five more. Rest. I will say, if your body is not used to working out with weight, it definitely tell it might feel a little heavy at first so that's why i was saying definitely take it easy okay and if you need to like me just rest your arms for a few for a few seconds and uh, put your weights beside you if you want to you can take if you want to you can take a water break all right next movement we're going to do five step curls okay we're gonna do 10 of these. So, with the bicep curls, you're just gonna, you'll be right to this level here and bring it up and make sure you extend it out. Just like that. Go at your own pace. All right, let's do five more. You all are doing so well. Two more. Okay, great job. Great job, you all. Okay, now the next movement. I'm going to, since this is a five pound weight, um, I'm gonna go ahead and put this down, all right? Now for the next exercise, if you have two weights and you want to do this exercise, you're more than welcome to. With this exercise, we're just going to um, hold our dumbbell, okay? I'm going to hold mine with both hands. You're going to pull it behind, pull it back up. Pull it behind, pull it back up. This is 
work in your shoulder blades. It's also working your triceps. Okay, let's do two more of these. going to do we're not going to go as far okay so we're going to hold it your dumbbells bring it back break it up Okay, 
Okay, so the next movement, gonna take our legs, right? Make sure your back is laying straight on, laying flat uh, for the, on the chair for support, okay? All right, so for this next move, we're gonna open up our legs. Then we're just gonna stretch down, okay? If you can touch the floor, that's fine. The most you can do is this, that's okay too. But we are stretching inside of our inner thigh. Also, gonna be helping to stretch our hips, our inner thighs. Shake them out. Shake them out. Okay. If you are able to do this, go ahead and pace those legs like you're running. If you want to, you can hold on to the side of your chair or put your hands in front of you. But keep going. Go whatever pace you can. Have the blood flowing. Just gonna put some blood flow and circulation into those legs. Okay, stop. Ooh, I can definitely feel the stimulation in my legs. <laughs> okay, let's do that one more time. Y'all ready? Just like you're jogging in place. It's just a little bit more comfortable. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more. 
before I breathe in.